eggnog fans are flocking to Montebello today. That is where a popular eggnog is made, and KCAL 9's Lori Perez also took the trip to Brogier's Dairy. It just says holiday spirit to me. I love it. It's the glass bottles and the old fashioned writing and the signs and building now 95 years old. All that plus one sip of this. And the crowds at Brogier's Dairy say they take a step back in time to the Christmases of their lives. Just the most creamy, wonderful eggnog ever. Every Christmas season, every day for weeks, dozens from around the block. I was born in this street. And around the region. We live in Marina Valley now. Start lining up at the crack of dawn. There was a guy here at Riverside at 5 o'clock this morning. For just the chance to bring home some of the Montebello Dairy's beloved beverage. The family owned and run operation makes several batches of 2,000 gallons each. And even at four some a quart, it still doesn't seem to be enough. Did you not? Yesterday, it looked like half of California was here. And if they weren't, the other half were here at like six this morning. They were lined up big time to get here early. As quick as they make it, fans take it. Tens of thousands of gallons causing food fights on Southern California tables every year. Do you ration it out when you get home and say, okay, well. Um, we try to, but it doesn't work. It's just first come, first serve. If you're the last in line, you might not get that. <laughs> Milk, cream, egg yolk, nutmeg, sugar. It's the same recipe since 1920 that keeps them coming back and back. I have to admit, this is my, you know, several -th time to get eggnog this Christmas season. Because he and others say Brogueres is bottling more than eggnog here. They're bottling Christmas. This uh, tradition, history, delicious. Merry Christmas. With lines like these, the eggnog won't flow forever. And when they're out, they're out until Tuesday when they'll make another batch just in time for New Year's Eve. In Montebello, I'm Lori Perez, KCAL 9 News.